welcome to another episode of Mama Zulu Health. I believe you've been well since the last time we were together. Today we are going to talk about our daily dosing. What is the daily dose? <coughs> How are you supposed to give your baby medication that is prescribed and for what duration? So when you go to a hospital, the doctor is supposed to write for you uh, the prescription. So when you go to the pharmacy, you will be given the medication with the amount of medicine you're supposed to give the baby, how many times and for how long. So when you're supposed to give your baby maybe 5 ml three times a day for five days, it should be written on the bottle or on the pack. So for example, a doctor tells you to give um, your medication three times in a day. So most of us including me, used to think that you give morning, lunch hour, and evening, but that is not exactly the case. So does it mean that if your baby wakes up at 10 a.m., you give your first dose, then akikula lunch, saa saba, unampea the second dose. Kama analala six, you don't want the baby to go to bed without taking their medication, so unampea the third dose, or how do you go about it? So what you do, one day has 24 hours. So you're supposed to take your 24 hours in a day, divide by the number of time you're supposed to give. So 24 divided by 3, you get 8. So one dose you're supposed to give after every 8 hours, so that you give 3 times throughout the day. If, for example, you're supposed to give 2 times a day, you take your 24 hours again, divide by the number of times, which is 2 times, and then you get 12 hours. So each medication you're supposed to give 12 hours apart. So you should not worry if the doctor told you to give the number of times but did not indicate how many other hours apart do not worry you just take your 24 hours in a day divide by the number of times you're supposed to give in a day then you know how many hours apart you're supposed to give so let's give the last example uh, let's say your doctor told you to give four times in a day you don't know how many hours when or where to give your medication just take your 24 hours divide by four hours you get six hours so your medication will be given after every six hours so again, if your doctor told you to give 5 ml, please make sure you have something calibrated. Don't use a spoon, don't use a cup that has no calibrations or a mark to show you where 5 ml is. Because most of the time you find that you're giving the wrong dosage. Because once some people have a spoon that is 6 ml, others 10 ml. So jaribu kutafuta, ask your doctor or your pharmacist to give you a spoon that is calibrated or a cup that is calibrated ile kipimo unataka. Sometimes you use syringes, spoons, cups. So just make sure umetafta enye miko calibrated. So if you need to give 3 ml, you actually know where to pull your syringe or where which type of spoon to use so that you make sure you give the right dosages at the right time for the right duration so that you reduce your baby's risk of getting an underdose reinfections or resistance to those medications unless otherwise advised by your doctor thank you so much i hope this will be of great help to you raising your baby in a healthy way and to you getting a complete treatment from your medications and please remember to subscribe to our channel for more of these videos Remember to leave a comment, ask any question that you wish. You can also suggest a topic that you would want us to talk about in our next episode and we will surely do that. Thank you so much. See you in our next video.